So let's take a look at how to create Excel file using Python's open by Excel module. First thing you can type in pip install open by Excel. Okay. If you have permission issues, then you can use Python dash M then PIP install and then open by Excel. Okay. That will install open by Excel module on your system. Okay. Once you do that, you are ready to execute the code within this video. Okay. So first thing, use from open by Excel. You can import workbook because anything that we do will be within the workbook. Okay. So let's first start using workbook and for that we have to also create one variable that calls it okay so workbook book equals workbook so we have a marker now that we are going to use and then we have to point to a worksheet so use sheet as variable and then call for book dot active Okay, so that should work out. Next thing is we have to use sheet and we have to create first row, first column, A1 element. And let's say I want to put some value over there, one five zero zero. Then sheet is B1. And I want to put value, let's say 2500 over there. And what if I want to have a timestamp? Okay, so let's import time. And here, let's add one formula, something like now equals to uh, here we use time and then string for my time. And then double quotes, percent. Okay, so next thing to do is simply use sheet and then C1. Make sure it's in quotes, C1. Okay, and pass it current time. Okay, so once you do that, you can use book.save and then you can simply use, let's say, Devonami demo one that Excel is X. Okay, so this is my file name and I'm going to check whether this Tonami demo one is properly stored. Also check what type of error it is. Okay, so the error for this was because the W in import was not capital. And so that remained consistent with initialization of constructor for workbook as well. Now, as you can see, once the command prompt is released, it should show you your output file in the directory. You can open that. You can also check the timestamp if this is the file that we just created. Okay, so this is my first row, first column, second and third. It shows the current date in third column, as you can see and the exact data that I have passed. So you found out how to use OpenPy Excel to create a workbook and add some data within your worksheet and save it in your drive, okay? So this was a short example on how to use OpenPy Excel to create Excel worksheet.